Hey Larry, wife's outside, kids asleep, my wife's asleep in the car, I just need something, bring back to the house, it's 95 degrees, just something to relax around the pool. What do you got that's good that's cold? You know, that, I need a wine that's grab and go for summertime, and that's where our temperature control. Hi, I'm Larry Baker. I am a certified level two sommelier and senior wine and spirit specialist here for ABC Fine Wines and Spirits in Sunrise, Florida, soon to be Miami, North Miami, Florida. Even in a restaurant or a retail store, when a restaurant, you look at the by the glass list, what offerings they have by the glass list, most consumers will notice that it's always the crap you don't want, the wines you want, they're trying to sell you a bob. Go into any retail store or supermarket that sells wine. Their cold sections are the ones that they sell volume of and never of the quality that you're looking for, but they got you. Convenience, your, your favorite white Zinfandel, your favorite sparkling wine, your favorite champagne, the brands you know, and you don't really get the selection in either place. That's how I can tell a good retail store or a good restaurant. A good restaurant has a really good buy the glass list, not just by the bottle list, but everything from $10 and up uh, to a great $50 even glass of wine uh, is very important because some people just want a great glass of wine, not say, well, I'll take your house wine. And in the, in, in the refrigerator, it always seems every brand you want they don't have cold, so they force you out of convenience, especially in summertime here in Florida where it's hot all the time and people have outdoor parties and pool parties. They just want something that they can grab that's already chilled, that's of quality, and not have to go home and make it quick. That's why I want to show you what my partner Jennifer and I, who's going to be working here uh, at the store when I go down to Miami, we always collaborate every month. We do it seasonally and pick out what we think the customers would like to try. So let's die, as Monty Hall would say, let's, let's start with door number one. Door number one is where we keep our champagnes and sparkling wines. And for those of you, I go over it again, there is a difference. Champagne comes from Champagne, France, everything else, I don't care what it says on the label, is a sparkling wine. <clears throat> if you like a brute wine, we definitely have our favorite Jean Noël Hatone, non-vintage for $29.99. No Chardonnay, it's a Blanc de Noir, only Pinot Meunier and Pinot Noir, cold, ready to go. If you want something that's a demi-sec, semi-sweet, we have Jean Noël Hatton Demi-sec, the rich, for $32.99. What are you looking for? We have a customer right here. Tell me. Dominio. Dominio de Pesena. Speaking of cava. This cava, we have a guest who cannot come on camera, it's against our rules, who loves this cava. It's $9.99, not your typical brand, but we put something in there from one of the most famous wineries in there, Mimosa. and we're going to hand it from Mimosas, the Mimosa. best mimosa. There you go, best mimosas, and this is how it happened, grab and go. Yeah, speaking of cava, we have a couple of them and the sparkling wine. Cavas are made in the method of champagne, and as, a as different as the Prosecco that we talk about, which is not made in that method, but the Prosecco Superior from Colalto. We also try to keep our sparkling wine separate from out here. We have some beautiful sparkling wines from Georgie in Italy that are made in the method Charmat where it's fermented, the, the second for the bubbles are created in the tank and not in the actual bottle. This, we have a silver and we have a rosé from him as well. Then the secret, uh, Franciacorta, which is my favorite region of Italy, Cantati Castaldi, uh, and that is from the uh, Franciacorta region of Italy. Method classical, double fermentation, almost maybe even better than champagne in my opinion, but we have that for $26.99. So we keep sparkling wines down there, even for a Sparkling wine, demi sec. We have a Cremant de Bourgogne from Vu Van Bal for $16.99, as well as for, and I want you to notice the back of this bottle, if Andrew can see that dry. Dry is not, it's actually less dry than extra dry, so it's a little bit fruity on the Faubourg 21. It's a Syrah from southern France. People love this bottle. It's so refreshing, like strawberries, raspberries, $16.99. And other sparkling wines down here, as you can see, from France, from Washington State. Uh, we have the Cavas and then the real champagne up above. Going to door number two on the top part, we like to call it our sweet section for people who like things that are sweet. Our famous Sangue de Judah from Fabiano Giorgi, Costa Rosa. 
nice, sweet, jammy white. He also makes a, I mean, red, and then we make a white, the Costa Rosa Bianco, which is Moscato, Malvasia, and Riesling. Lambrusco. Love to talk about Lambrusco because this one is not your industrial Lambrusco. This is from the Gasparosa grape, and this is Cleto Chiarli, and this is Amabile, Amabile, which means like a demi, semi sweet, served in five star Osterias in Emilia Romano. We have some Rieslings and other sweet wines and Moscatos. Down here, Jennifer's idea was to do, and I love rosés, but not just Provence. We do have rosés from Provence. We even have a delicious $7.99, which we showed before, with grapefruit flavors from France. It's nice and refreshing. This is the perfect pool wine. Pour this over some crushed ice, or just keep it really cold on a bucket of ice. So refreshing to sit around the pool. As well as Italian rosés from Giovanna Tantini in Bartolino. It's a blend of uh, Corvina mostly, a little bit a dollop of Rondinella as well as the American side from Stuart Bodecker and his Reflection 100% Pinot Noir Rosé. And then of course we have a few from Provence and other areas in France. And for 1.5 liters down there we have probably one of the best Pinot Grigios you've ever had from Friuli, his Zelina Pinot Grigio. Uh, even my camera person Andrew said, this stuff is so easy to sell. His mom drinks it. He buys it every week, $12.99 from Friuli. Great Pinot Grigio, and even if you wanted to pick up a bottle of sangria from Bodegas Val de Pablo, this is like real sangria. They are in Zaragoza, Spain, with real Spanish wine, real fruits, tastes like you made it yourself. You walk out of this with the, what is it, $8.99 on sale, and you've got a 1.5 liter of the best sangria we have. Uh, finishing up in door number three, we keep our whites. Sure, we have Chardonnay of the brands you know, but we have Chardonnays in the style and the California Chardonnay, but how many people keep a Chablis, a Burgundy, a white Burgundy in the cold box? Not many. Not many stores keep something that is unoaked and crisp and clean. Uh, we have Sauvignon Blancs as well, but how many people keep a white Bordeaux like Chateau de Tuileries from Graves? Sauvignon Blanc and Semillon probably, and the melon flavors and the gravel, that's how the town got the name Graves. It's a, we just put that in the uh, uh, Sauvignon Blanc area because it's a white Bordeaux, which is mostly Sauvignon Blanc or 50-50, as well as New Zealand, your typical. And we even keep a Washington State Sauvignon Blanc from Annette Bergevin and Amber Lane, the linen, soft like linen. Lady just bought a couple of bottles right now. She said uh, one of her faves. And then we go down to many expressions of Pinot Grigio, where you're not just gonna get Italian Pinot Grigio, although we have those, we also have New Zealand Pinot Gris, which is Pinot Grigio from Juice Taylor. We have Pinot Grigio, of course, from uh, Italy, which is Colalto. And that is Princess Isabella Colalto in Venice. I love that. So we have different expressions of the great Pinot Gris, including from New Zealand, and even one from Alsace, France, which Andrew just sold to somebody who wanted organic. Don't panic, it's organic. A little off dry style on the border of France and Germany. So not just Italian Pinot Grigio. And then on the bottom, we have also some other expressions of Sauvignon Blanc. And for somebody who wants a demi-sec, Chateau Mon Contour is a Vouvray from the town of Vouvray, demi-sec, Chenin Blanc. So to go over this, I mean, I think we have pretty much a good selection of Door number one, two, three, from champagnes to sparkling wines that you normally wouldn't see, a brand that you haven't heard of, to wonderful sweet wines, to an entire row. Jennifer, again, did the beautiful job with the selections that we collaborated, making a rosé section for summer, to 1.5 liters that you normally don't see, even sangria, to door number three with Chardonnays and expressions of uh, Pinot Gris or Pinot Grigio, and a different expressions of Sauvignon Blanc, and even a demi-sec Chenin Blanc. That's a pretty darn good selection, if I do say so myself, and to you, Jennifer, for helping. For any further information on these wines, go to our website at www.abcfws.com, or just hit me up on the blog and say, hey, uh, what, do you, what do you got in your cold box there? You're going to be pleasantly surprised, because remember, wine is not for snobs. It's for everyday people like you and me who need a wine to grab and go.